This is a video demonstration for how to uninstall Pareto Logic Internet Security from your computer. So the first thing you need to do is make sure the program's been shut off completely. You can do that by going down to the bottom right here, finding the icon. If the icon is down there in the system tray, that means the program is running in the background. So to make sure it's shut off, you can right click on some empty space on the taskbar here, and then click on Start Task Manager. Go over to the Processes tab. Usually it starts on Applications, but Processes is what you want. You can click on Image Name to sort the list alphabetically. Look down the list for Pareto Logic Internet Security. Click on it. Click on End Process. Then you can click on End Process again. And it'll be removed from the list. Won't be running in the background anymore. You can have a look down in the bottom right. You can see that the icon disappears. So now that we know it's not running in the background anymore, you can uninstall the program. Click on the Start menu, click on Control Panel, and then Programs and Features is the section that you're looking for. If you've got the Category view, then you'll want to be looking for Uninstall a Program. And in the Programs and Features section, there will be a big list of all the programs on your computer. should be sorted alphabetically, so have a look down for Pareto Logic Internet Security. Click on it, and click on the Uninstall button. So the Uninstaller will come up. It'll walk you through the process. And uninstalling shouldn't take too long. It's just going to delete all the files that are associated with the program. You might get some messages saying that your antivirus has been disabled, something like that. That's normal. You're uninstalling your antivirus, so of course you won't have one. And when the uninstaller is finished, you'll see that the program is removed from the list. And you can see that the desktop icon is gone. It's not running in the system tray down in the bottom right, so it's been removed from your computer, and you're finished. The program has now been uninstalled. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us or have a look at the other videos in this series.